Welcome to the second edition of Plug In with Avi and Kyle. We are the internet's odd couple who just happen to be your best source for everything that is anything. Tech, news, and product reviews. The only topic we promise to never cover is the Kardashians. That's right. Uh, wow, Avi, today we have some great stuff to co- cover. We have guests. Uh, our guest will be actor, YouTube celebrity, and close personal friend of mine. Okay. Um, uh, Lawrence Cow <laughs> from his world-famous I Am Lawrence Cow YouTube channel. Okay, and uh, we are going to talk a little bit about the 4K and what you should do. We are going to review one of the products from Aperture, the new product that they came up with. Oh, yeah. And we will be talking about some world politics and what's happening in the world. And that's the main course. Our goal is to have the program going when you want it, where you want it, and literally talk about what you want to hear. So our focus is to listen to you and let us know in every time we you see our uh, podcast, to let us know what you want to listen to. Yeah, and if you want to do that, you can tweet at, uh, at PluginPod on Twitter or send us an email at PluginPod at Gmail and, uh, with any topics or comments about uh, the show, and we'll be sure to include those in the next show. Did you have our Facebook too? Oh, do we have a Facebook now? I thought we do. Oh, well, then uh, Facebook is, is it Plugin Pod on Facebook? Oh, Claudia just told me it's Plugin Pod as well on <laughs> Facebook, so that's cool. Okay. Uh, do we have anything else? Instagram? Oh, she's, she's telling me all this stuff from the side. <laughs> so we also have Instagram, Plugin Pod, correct? And what else do we have? A grinder? No grinder? <laughs> oh, darn it. Okay. Well, oh, just dropped my phone. So, uh, well, first things first, let's get let's get back on track here. Uh, Mr. Avi, why did we decide to do something like start a visual radio podcast? Well, the idea is, again, we want it to be connected directly to our listeners and give them a visual of what we talk about. So we, when we talk about product, they can see the actual product and they can experience it as we will experience it through the video. And it's in www, what you want, when you want, where you want. <laughs> And that's the name of the show. All right. Well, um, that sounds good to me. So why don't we just get started with the show? Great. Well, enough about us. Let's open up our second show with my very dear friend. Uh, my boy, I guess you could call him. I'm your boy. Star of <laughs> stage and screen, the one and only Mr. Lawrence Cow. Everything this man touches turns to gold. Really? Welcome to the show. I have the Midas touch. You do. You yeah, have I the do. Midas touch. Breaks. You do a lot of I feel breaks. so honored to be on a show, like to be on a podcast. It's so crazy. Yeah. Like, he I mean, comes in and walks in and he said, I'm nervous. A guy that's yeah, been doing I'm, YouTube yeah. his, li- nervous, his life. Super nervous, man. <laughs> that's crazy. It's, it's, I'm always nervous doing stuff. Oh, well, come on. Especially expressing my opinions. I'm just like, whoa. Yeah, well, you don't have any opinions. I, I know, exactly. So <laughs> I'm going to have to make them up. I'm, gonna, I'm acting right now. Yeah, yeah. Got to create a character. Well, how about this then? What was your most nerve wracking time since you've been nerve-wracking doing Nerve wracking time. Uh, it, it's definitely been, uh, I think, just recently, like when I was in Atlanta, when yeah. I was shooting Insurgent, because uh-huh. like my first scene is with Kate Winslet. I don't really say that much, yeah. but then I'm just walking and she like, she comes up to us and she's like, um, she's like, hey guys, uh, as you get older, uh, it's just going to get harder and harder. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, okay. She's trying to like talk to us. She's yeah. being really nice. And then she goes, last night I had this dream that um, I was on set and these these young, young girls were like, like killing it they were doing so good and she got really afraid she just went to her car and drove away because she thought she sucked as an actress and then they called action yeah and i had the first line so i, like, I was like oh my gosh it's 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 really nerve-wracking oh that's crazy it so, went blank huh? yeah yeah what did well, she think you were like 12 like, yeah she i'm like 13 actor? and a half yeah, so yeah, yeah. yeah maybe 12 yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. we don't that's, you know asians yeah, yeah, yeah. don't, don't age. age 12 no 13 age. same yeah. thing <laughs> So what are you re- uh, currently working on? Nothing right now. Nothing. Yeah, just good. waiting. I'm just like, you know, hurry up and wait. That's how it is in Hollywood. That really is how it is, man. It, it's it's tough. It's just going to interview. It's like going to a, a job interview over and over again. That becomes your job. It's like the nightmare uh, or the the. Uh, hot, uh, grand, uh, grand Groundhog's, Groundhog's, yeah, Groundhog's Day, Day Groundhog yeah. Hot. Yeah. It, well, it, sounds yeah. like, it sounds like, uh, well, it wouldn't be a nightmare for you, though. This is what you want to do. This yeah, is no, career. it is. And uh, it's funny because, you know, once you start working, that becomes like the, vaca- the vacation. You know, the job is pretty much to yeah. go and audition for things yeah. and to get rejected yeah. over yeah, yeah. and over Well, recently again. you were in uh, Fast Company. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, how was that? Because that's the first time I think I've seen you on stage. Oh, man, that was great. Uh, it's a really prestigious um, theater company, company, so I was blessed. I was super lucky to be a, a part of that theater company. It was a lot of fun. And uh, it's a huge stage. It's at the uh, uh, South, Coast, South Coast Repertory. Yeah. Yeah. So, so do you was... like do you like more stage acting or film acting? Um, I love film because of um, all oh, the people that takes. are involved. It's like it's like a teamwork, yeah, team yeah. effort. And uh, the thing about theater, which is awesome, is that there's like instantaneous gratification because like you perform and then people applaud. They tell you if they hate it or if they like it on the spot. Yeah. yeah but for film, it's like you have to wait like five years before they release a film <laughs> and then you're just like well okay i i i did it but then that's it, it you yeah. know yeah. where is it where's yeah. the sex scene that i just yeah. did you yeah, know? yeah exactly <laughs> where am i gonna see that do you ever ask just for a cut of just the sex scenes oh uh, yeah yeah of course man <laughs> just so i can uh do naughty things to myself later <laughs> in the bedroom. Yeah. i don't know entertain yourself <laughs> entertain you? myself yeah okay. so right. um if i remember correctly uh, when we first met yeah you told me how shy you were I'm still shy, man. Yeah, but I mean... I just need some caffeine. If this is shy... Thank God for Starbucks. Yeah, well, <laughs> Give man. him a plug. If Starbucks and pills. <laughs> <laughs> um, but you really started with kind of coming out of your shell, you said, with Cabo Modern, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Just... Um... Just dancing uh, in college definitely helped me, I think. Well, let's take so, it back. You di didn't even dance when you joined Kaba. Oh, no, not at all. Why did you join Kaba? Um, well, I told you this before. <laughs> um, I, I wanted to do to something Adele, in college. Right? Okay. Whoa. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. To meet love of my life. Yeah. Maybe, maybe studying when you go to college? <laughs> maybe study. Maybe study. But I wanted to do some kind of extracurricular activities. Oh, and okay. then I saw, like, this dance team. And there were all these hot girls um, oh, they were okay. dancing, and I'm like, man, I want to do that because I want to hang out with them. Yeah, <laughs> obviously. Okay. And now you've become like a world. Re well, I mean, you're a big time dancer now. I guess so. so. How did you break into <laughs> YouTube then? What? Um, you know, I just needed an outlet, something mm -hmm. to 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 make and create stuff. Okay. So I thought that YouTube would be a good um, platform to actually make stuff and show people what I'm doing. Because I have a lot of peers that are dancers, and yeah. it's easy for them to just like, hey, I'm going to choreograph something and let people see it. And I thought, like, you know, like, I feel like an actor should be able to do that, too. Of course. Or, or a writer should be able to do that, too. You know, if you're a director, I feel like you just need some kind of platform to let something out, mm -hmm. you know, so that you can artistically grow, too, at so the same So if time. you, what, uh, then your advice to somebody that has the talent and don't know how to get it out to the public? I think just start doing it. Like, it's going to suck in the beginning. Like, uh -huh. your product is going to be terrible. But, you know, you just have to accept that and just keep pushing forward. Eventually, it's just going to get better and better. Especially with yeah. the... The uh, comments people leave. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Comments are great. They're, They're funny, man. Yeah. They're the hurtful, hurtful one. Yeah. And the good but you one. can you can write stuff back that can hurt them too. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> My mom gets mad when I write stuff back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kyle yeah. knows. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 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 She gave him a, a mouthful one day yeah. when, uh, because of something he had written back to someone. <laughs> yeah. I, remember, I felt it like I was in trouble. It wasn't kind <laughs> enough, huh? Why yeah. they, you know? I thought it was funny. I told them they were just angry because their mother had a penis. <laughs> but I mean, it's not that bad. I don't think, I thought it was funny. Yeah, yeah. It's, that's, that's not, funny, right? Out of all the things you could have said, that is probably the least offensive. Yeah. In that, that's in that yeah. realm. You My know? mom was trying to tell me, he's like, you know, like, what if, like, you know, what if his mom does? Like, or like, what if, like, you know, you that's never know. What if his so mom? Nice. Yeah, my mom is super she's nice. She's so thoughtful. She's super thoughtful. Yeah, she's so thoughtful. I love my mom. Yeah. Oh, man. So, um, so you started, did you act in high school? Oh, yes. Yeah, I did. I started acting in high, my junior year in high school. Um, I think that's really what opened me up, too, yeah. um, just so that I could just say, Whatever is on my mind, yeah, you know, just yeah. be crazy. Yeah. And then I thought, you know, this is fun. I could just let loose. Uh -huh. I'm an only child, too, so I have a lot of, like, random <laughs> thoughts in my head. The and, only child. That I don't yeah. really get to express, yeah. you know, yeah. except by myself in my room like a <laughs> yeah. crazy person. Yeah, yeah. So what do you think your masterpiece work up to today? Up to today? Yeah. Oh, man. That you are really proud of. Ultimate Detectives. <laughs> <laughs> I think well, that worked. Ultimate Detectives. <laughs> Yeah, that was great. Me and Kyle, we always work on stuff together. It's, yeah, yeah, it's fun. Uh, he wants you to plug his Ultimate Detective. <laughs> well, wait. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Anyway, go. What was your? So back to what you were I saying. I think. I think that the best work that I've ever done, or I feel like ha has created, it hasn't been 
that I, I haven't been able to show like online or anything. It's mm-hmm. more like stuff that I do. I, I go to a class on Sundays. Yeah. It's like an acting class, and then that, that's where we explore like stuff that we're yeah. able to do and the stuff that we're working on. And mm-hmm. I think that's where like most of the creative uh, juices flow and, and, and come out. I get to see other people and peers work. Like do you on record stage any and, of it? Do you? Show uh, no, it? we don't record any of it. Wait, so we did just, once. We did once, but like all that all stuff that got, got deleted because my <laughs> my dumbass just doesn't back up my computer. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh I lost but everything. I hear a lot about your class though from uh, you and uh, the a few other people in there that yeah, I Yeah, uh, I love the class. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah. If you guys if if you got if there's any actors out there you guys want to learn and and um, understand yourself and explore more of like your own creativity, I suggest you go to Stuart Rogers Studio. It's in North Hollywood. It's awesome. And they right. just got new seats, right? Yeah, we just got new seats. Wow. I Instagrammed it. Wow. Um, they're really comfortable, man. Yeah, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> that's the number one reason you should go there, brand new seats. Yeah, brand new seats. They're comfortable. You can fall asleep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it doesn't matter what the classes are. Just go for the seats. Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. Go to pass out. That's what I did in college. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the seats in college are awesome. <laughs> really? Yeah, they are. At UCI, right? Yeah, UCI. UC Irvine. Yeah. I definitely have passed out. And uh, yeah. I, I remember a teacher, like, waking me up, like, hey... And I wake, I wake up and there's no one else in 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 the, in the <laughs> class. There's like 200 students in the class. I wake so that's up like half of what I missed going to community college. <laughs> no, the comfortable know. seats in the colleges you pay a lot of money to go to. Exactly. Well, the, you pay to rest. Yeah. <laughs> 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 pay to rest. <laughs> to get the shade on the comfortable seat. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Exactly. At least Avi knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Do they play at least soft music or whatever to put you to sleep? Um, <laughs> no, that's a teacher talking. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Very nice. Very All nice. Right. So you've been on an epi- episodes of Walking Dead. Yeah. You've been on NCIS. You've been in the new... Uh, you're in the new... Con- it's called Insurgent. Insurgent. Yeah, it's a sequel it, to Divergent. It's a sequel to Vi- yeah. Divergent. I wrote it down as Convergence. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> I know. saw. I'm like, what is Convergence? <laughs> it's a movie that I'm not in yet. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You can predict, predict the future. Yeah. yeah. Um, but... The, I mean, besides that, you're still dancing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You still dance with Kinjas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I still dance with Kinjas. That's um, it's fun. It's, I mean, I, I love dancing. I'm never going to throw that away, yeah. you know? I, I love it a lot. And I love especially dancing with my friends. Yeah. So I think that's uh, that's the best part. So are you with a dance company or dance group or you, you just... Uh... It's a dance crew. It's a bunch of us the that Kinjas. we've been friends for like maybe 10 years. Okay. Uh, and then... Um, we all dance. They're together. okay. You, yeah, we're okay. We're whatever. Do you perform anywhere in public or just? Uh, yeah, your... there's like annual dance competitions that we do. Um, they're not really. We're not there to compete. We're just there to like um, to exhibit. enjoy yourself. Yeah. Yeah. And what the type of dancing is it? Uh, it's just hip hop dancing. Style, oh, well, right okay, now. great. So, well, thank you, Lawrence. Yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll be back For with sure. Lawrence after the commercial break. He's going to stay with us as a guest host and oh, see no. you after the commercial.